This presentation shows the importance of brushing and flossing our teeth. This mega block represents our teeth and gums. I have bits of Play-Doh. Orange Play-Doh will represent the germs that stick to our teeth. These germs can be called bacteria. Sometimes they're called sugar bugs. Plaque is a group of these germs that get together and plaque sticks to our teeth and does not come off of our teeth until we brush and floss it away. Plaque takes the food that it finds in our mouth after we eat and drink things and plaque loves sugary sweet foods. So these food particles hide everywhere in our mouth as well. And when the plaque eats those food particles up, it makes acid with them. Acid, when it sits on our teeth for a long time, can cause cavities. So we want to make sure that we are removing the food particles and plaque from our teeth daily. When we brush, we want to brush for at least two minutes. We're going to brush in tiny circles. We want to tilt our toothbrush down towards the gum line. When we brush, we're going to jiggle those germs off of our teeth. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Do the inside. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. Brush your chewing surface. Circular motions. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle those germs off your teeth. And as you can see, when I'm finished brushing, there is still food and germs left between our teeth. This is why it is so important to floss our teeth. Many dentists recommend that children use flossers instead of the string floss because it's much easier to get the flosser and hold the flosser in between your teeth, whereas the string floss, you have to wrap it around and reach way in the back. When we floss, I have a flosser here that has some black floss on it to help you see it against my white teeth. The flosser, when we floss, we want to push that flosser up against those teeth so it hugs the tooth. We're not just putting it down in here and going up and down. We actually want to hug that tooth. Wipe that floss against the side of that tooth. Take those germs out of there. And then to get this other chewing surface, we're going to, I mean, in between our teeth, we're going to wipe that floss, hug against the tooth again, pull towards your tooth, wipe that out of there. Clean your flosser between each tooth so that you know you're getting food and plaque away from your teeth and you're not sticking it back in between your teeth. So you want to clean that off and then continue flossing until it is clean in that area. You want to make sure that you are cleaning all of the food and plaque out of there. So clean in between each set of teeth. There's some more food or germs. So we wanna make sure that we are cleaning that out of there and cleaning our flosser off each time we clean. So once we have cleaned between all of our teeth, you can see that now our teeth are clean. This is why it is important to brush and floss every day. Soda has a lot of sugar and acid in it. This is not healthy for our teeth. Hey, what are you doing? I just need one more to finish my masterpiece. Did you drink all those? Uh, Straight. Well, not all. Today. Do you know how much sugar you drank? Hmm? Each can has almost 10 teaspoons of sugar. Have one super gulpy sized soda, and that's 32 teaspoons of sugar from one drink. Think how much that is in a year. If you drink three cans of soda a day, easy, you'll be drinking a quarter pound of sugar. That's almost two pounds of sugar a week. More than seven pounds a month. And you drink over 91 pounds of sugar a year. That's more than your own body weight. Just from soda. So, what are you saying? Did you ever think of water? <sighs> Refreshing. What do you call that again? Water. <laughs> Sweet. Rethink your drink. Choose water. People need to protect their teeth. Here are some things that people do that can hurt teeth. Do you play sports? If you play football, baseball, soccer, karate, or any sports with other people, you may need to wear a mouth guard to protect your teeth. Ask your dentist about using a mouth guard. Remember, take care of your teeth. You can keep cavities away. Brush two times a day for two minutes each time. Floss one time a day. Eat healthy foods. Drink water. Visit the dentist two times a year. Keep on smiling. Step one, use a bit of toothpaste. Not much, a pea-sized amount will do. Step two, start brushing your back teeth and molars. 
Brush the outside of your upper and lower teeth. Hold the toothbrush at a 45 degree angle. Movements should be gentle and short. Brushing the teeth from top to bottom and from bottom to top. You could also move the toothbrush in small circular motions. Step 3. Brush the inside of your upper and lower teeth. Remember to reach and clean back molars too. Step 4. Brush the chewing surfaces with back and forth motions. Step 5. Now you should clean the rest of your mouth. Brush gently inside of your cheeks and your tongue. Step 6. Spit out any excess toothpaste and rinse.